Alrighty guys, so in today's video I want to show you how to assign a partner in Facebook Business Manager. So if you're looking to outsource work or you're looking for someone that uh, needs to run your Facebook page and run ads for you and you want to keep it in one place, this is video for you. So it's going to be a quick little tutorial uh, how, to, uh, how, to, how to do that. Uh, so sit back, relax and let's jump right away into it. So first thing, if you have already a person that you want to assign as a partner uh, in Facebook Business Manager, they would need to send you their ID, the business ID and is, they can find it. I'm going to show you where they can find it. If, if they click on business settings and you know on the left side you always have uh, the ID, either is uh, a Facebook ad account ID or a business ID. So there they're going to take, copy that ID and send it to you. And uh, then next step guys, once you have the ID, you're going to go here and um, I'm going to show from the stress. First, you want to create a project. Let's say you're working with your client, you're going to add new. Then you're going to give a name of a project. And after that, your project is going to be right here. Then you want, you want to go click on pages and assign assets. So you're going to add page, whatever page you, uh, you want to create a project then after that you will need uh, you will get uh, add the account you're gonna click on assign assets and add uh, add account and pretty much it's that's it if you're working on the apps you're gonna add apps or Instagram accounts so you're gonna you're gonna create a project then uh, there are two options first you, you want to assign a partner so you want to click on assign assets the same and uh, you will find the pages you have let's say you want to do this then you click on assign asset then you want to click and assign asset for ad account and the same options right here you know if you want to share the pixel of a specific page you just click here and uh, pick the pixel uh, and uh, there are a couple different options as well right so from here you want to you once you have that uh, you want to go here on people and assets and you need to click add new first it's important you want to click add new people and it gives you a few see it gives you an option kind of like when you hire an employee so or you can give full access and make someone as an admin so you want to click on employee uh, if it's someone that you are hiring to your agency or it's someone that you want just split the work so you're gonna click on employee and here you're not gonna put the business ID here you want to put the their email associated with a Facebook once you do that, uh, you're gonna click next, and then it's gonna. I wish I could uh, show you. And then it's gonna be. Let me see. If I would try just random email, let's say Roger at gmail. gmail.com. Okay, cool. So next, you're gonna put the email. Then it, uh, it would ask you what uh, page you want to give access that person to manage. You will pick your page. Uh, let's say this one and then obviously you're gonna give the uh, access to ad account that you're gonna run ads from and then you're gonna skip uh, you can skip or click next and that's pretty much it guys and after that I wish it now I don't know if I can cancel that the Roger is gonna be my team anyways anyways uh, then after that they're gonna approve it's gonna uh, get they will get a notification on Facebook uh, that they need to approve a request uh, to be a partner and that's it that they will have a full access to your page to your ad account and they will be able to manage and run ads for you that pretty much it guys for this video it was like small video tutorial I wanted to share with you because it took me a while you know to figure everything out uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave your comment. Uh, also, give this video a thumbs up if you like it. Uh, give me also feedback uh, what I can do better. And again, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day and I'll see you tomorrow.